All right, now we are now back at my office. We are now here. I went ahead and imported the photos to Lily's shoot that we have done. So now I just want to kind of go through here. I'm going to go ahead and put you through the iPad and tell you exactly and just kind of cull through these, um, you know, just kind of cull through all the images before I send them off. And once again, I did shoot this all in black and white, guys. So everything's going to be in black and white. Like I said, I'm going to go ahead and call through these and just kind of show you my process. I do have videos on that situation of how I do that um, on my channel. So just go look out for those. But I'm just going to go call through it. So let's just go ahead and go straight to the iPad here. So as you can see, everything is in black and white the way I kept it. So the first thing I'm pretty much going to do is just get rid of everything. And then for the most part, I'm going to speed this through. Um, so for the most part, I'm just going to get rid of everything that just out of focus. First thing I'm going to focus is on the only thing that's out of focus. That's the first thing I'm going to focus on. Just kind of help everything eliminate things. And of course, obvious things like this right here. I don't like how he is cut off. So that's obvious going to be gone. So let's just kind of call through these. See what I can find here. I get rid of some, you know, if they're obvious enough that I know I'm not going to use then I'm just going to go ahead and cut them loose. Like this right here, cut her head off a little bit too much. Yeah, cut her head off a little bit too much. I actually like this one. It was, I know it was by accident, but I actually like this. So I think I'm going to keep it. Uh, this one too. I actually like this one. Let's go ahead. Let me put an auto on this one, brighten it up a little bit. Yeah, I do like this one actually. So I think I might keep these two, even though these was total accidents. Sometimes you get good photos out of accidents. Uh, let's see, let me go back, go here, get rid of that. I really don't like how I did that. I like it, but I don't like the angle. Like when we were shooting this, as you can see, guys, I've already seen the video, but most of the time I'll just kind of let her just go at it and just trying to get more candid photos instead of me trying to pose her all the time. So that was the whole situation there. So I'm not really focusing on uh, when she you knows she's going candid at things, I'm at a certain positioning, you know, what I'm saying, and she's just kind of free fall flowing with it. I don't want to kind of interrupt that. So, and most of these I'm pretty much will probably keep in black and white here. I really like that one. But like I said, what I'm first doing is just kind of going through and combing through. I don't like that at all. I don't like how her elbow looks. Uh, I don't like that one. So, I'm gonna get the ones I know it's obvious that I don't like, but most likely I'm just kind of focusing on the ones that's out of focus, which is really what I'm trying to focus on right now. This one's okay. So some are actually like really like some of these where she's out of focus, I re I'm really actually really enjoying a lot actually. The ones I thought, but I was just looking like looking more for like a really hardcore ones that's out of focus. And believe it or not, guys, I actually shot this whole entire thing in Aperture Priority, too. So that's another thing. Like, I shot this whole entire shoot in Aperture Priority. There's nothing wrong with using Aperture Priority every, every once in a while. That's why you see some of them, some of them like, how they're really, really dark, and then some of them kind of really, really light. That's because I was shooting in uh, Aperture Priority uh, with Auto ISO. Focus. So yeah, so this is what I'm going to do right now. So I'm just going to go ahead and go, go through these. Like I said, I just want to come here and just jump on just real quick to kind of show you what I am doing. I'm going to continue to do this and just go ahead and ride out. So the next thing you're going to kind of see me doing from here is I'm going to go ahead and show you a little bit of the editing process as well. How I'm going to edit these. Uh, once you went ahead and pick them, then I'm going to edit them a few of them and then show you how I'm just going to edit these black and white ones. I think I'm really going to keep them in black and white guys. Um, like if I don't want to put them in black and white, you just got to go here and just, they look pretty good. Here, here's an example. They look pretty good in regular suit. Look at that. Like it, it looks good even in, in the color, but I think I'm really going to keep it in black and white for these. Well, again, I may use a couple of color ones just to have a little variety, but for the most part, the ones that's going to get uh, submitted to Vogue is going to be probably more than, more than likely black and white, but I probably would do a combination of both uh, whatever photos I do choose, I'll probably do a combination of in color, have a color edit, then also a black and white edit. So yeah, so I guess the next time you're gonna see me is actually talking about and just it's just showing me editing this. So like I said, baby, this is just all these these different steps to the road to vote. Here we go.